Humanity is unable to answer life's biggest questions. Where did we come from? Why are we here? Is there a God? What is our future? To crack the puzzle to life itself, an elite research team was formed, one utilizing an entirely new approach to research that provides unprecedented effectiveness and capability. The Horizon Project is a team of the best scientific minds and researchers from around the world in every specialty. They have come together to compare notes and information in order to discern the truth. When all of the minds get together and all the information is pulled together, an entirely new picture arises. A picture so monumental, it encompasses every aspect of our existence and changes everything we thought we knew about our world. In order to look at the big picture, we have to look at our past. And in looking at our past, we see gaps in human history. Gaps caused by world catastrophes. Gaps which reset human evolution. These gaps, missing pieces to the puzzle, have plagued scientists and researchers for years, often creating more questions than answers. But now, the missing pieces have been found and the truth is revealed. So this is the beginning of the Horizon Project. We've all heard that the world is going to come to an end. Should we be bracing for tomorrow, as foretold by countless ancient texts and prophets for thousands of years? Are we really standing at the beginning of the end of the world? If so, there should be overwhelming scientific evidence scattered throughout our entire world. And that evidence should be right under our noses. Technology has allowed us to expand our knowledge base at an increasingly experiential rate. Our capability to share knowledge through broadcast media, the internet, and global communications has created entirely new methodologies for problem solving and human advancement. However, the ability to obtain virtually all known information from a simple keystroke comes with a price. We tend to believe or are more influenced by the information we're first presented with. Any information usually presented after that initial introduction is now processed by our reasoning and it must compete with the assumptions we are taught. As a result, we are constantly scrutinizing new information and discoveries, especially if they directly contradict what we think we already know. But it is also human nature to identify our own pitfalls, conducting research and formulating philosophies to uncover the truth. We strive to know who we are, where we came from, and to discover once and for all if we are made up of more than the sum of our parts. Our unprecedented growth of knowledge and technology has created a sea of overwhelming information which bombards us on a daily basis. Our cycle of advancement has led to growth so vast we have been forced into and now suffer from over-specialization. Working so close to the grindstone, we neglect to see the big picture, even when it stares us right in the face. As we gaze throughout our past, from what researchers believe are the earliest records of organized human civilization, we make a shocking discovery. A discovery that contradicts monumental portions of previously perceived human history. But it turns out that this discovery is no secret at all. It has simply been ignored. Gaps. Unexplained gaps in human history emerge. The more one dives into our unknown history, the more conflicts you'll find. These gaps take place not only within ancient societies, but in ancient technologies as well. It is commonly believed that man gradually moves through each generation, increasingly becoming more advanced and knowledgeable as time progresses. As a result, modern man in today's society is widely believed to be the pinnacle of human accomplishment. 
This may have been true in regard to recent history, but as we progress farther into our past, into a realm in which our perceived knowledge begins to dwindle and skew, an entirely different picture emerges. A new picture emerges indeed. Brain surgery. This ability requires knowledge in a multitude of fields and advancements, not only utilizing technology and instrumentation, but knowledge of the inner workings of the human body and brain. Also obtaining the ability to not only diagnose a problem, but to determine the associated cause and execute the correct surgical solution. Brain surgery, however, is not new. Researchers have found evidence that successful brain surgeries have taken place as far back as seven and nine thousand years ago. But that's only the beginning. We see leaps of technological advancements that were previously believed to be impossible. Located in an underground cavern below the Hathor Temple in Dendera, Egypt, pictures of bulb-like devices were identified. The components, carved in detail, look much like a modern high-voltage insulator. However, the thin end of the device depicts a cable-like component running into a glass bulb. The entire arrangement of the components has a striking resemblance to a modern-day electric lamp. In 1938, a German archaeologist discovered a puzzling ancient container. Now believed to be over 2,200 years old, the remaining intact components recovered were constructed in such a manner that even for conservative researchers, there is little doubt the ancient device was utilized as what we would today call a battery. And this is only the tip of what researchers are discovering. Contradictory to what we believed, it seems that neither light nor electricity is a product of modern man, but has existed for at least 2,000 years. The pieces to this ageless mystery begin to stack, from remarkably detailed and accurate ancient world maps to recovered mechanical devices, one in particular that was so complex, researchers believe it to be the oldest mechanical machine to yet be discovered, an ancient calculator. Remember, this is only the tip of the iceberg. All of these discoveries and countless others from ancient periods in which it was thought inconceivable for man to create and utilize electricity or accurately navigate our globe or conduct precise brain surgery or what we would call today a calculator or battery. There is definitely something not quite right with our perceived view of human history and ancient technology. If Earth in the past was abundant with billions of human lives, capable of worldwide trade, communications, accomplishing informational and technical advancements similar to today, then why has this knowledge not been passed on? Why the sudden break in human evolution that makes our past such an unknown secret? As additional clues are acquired, many of the gaps identified throughout human history begin to cluster and a pattern emerges. A pattern that suggests that human advancement took place far differently than we believed. The concern, however, is not what technologies and knowledge these ancient civilizations possessed, but what happened to it. To fully understand the cycle of our society and knowledge as it's passed down through hundreds and thousands of years, let's consider this hypothetical scenario. If somehow our world today underwent a cataclysm, one that greatly reduced Earth's human population and destroyed our communications and commerce infrastructure, in less than a generation, our computer technology, electrical generators, and mechanical devices would begin breaking down. As time continued, all the technology and knowledge that made up our incredible world today would become legend. Even photos themselves showcasing such monumental feats would decay and disappear in only a few hundred years. So what would we leave behind? The same thing that we find today from ancients that came before us, stone ruins and structures that could stand the test of time. 